Hello everyone, NASCAR stuff here with a really cool diecast review here. It's Del Earnhardt's number three good wrench service plus seventy six win no bull once in five winner. I forgot what race, but I believe this is the last win of his career before he died. And what's the funny thing, which I know they meant to do this on purpose, but there are only seventy six thousand and three uh, of these made. Which this is a 76 one and also to a number three car, so I know they did that on purpose. Really nice diecast. It was, I believe, eleven dollars. However, I'm giving both of these diecasts to a uh, uncle because he loves NASCAR and his favorite driver is Dylan Hart, and I know he doesn't have these cars. So I'm gonna go ahead and open this one up. I almost got this car for myself, but there's another car that I really wanted, so that's even cooler than this one, and the car just fell out by itself. Nice going, Dill. And I cannot get the collector card out of this. So here's the card. You got the same um, card that he raced. It might have been at Richmond. Then they got the Winston Noble 5 winner. Action Racing Collectibles. Good winch. Service Plus, RCR, and there's this car. On the back, we just got more advertisement by Action Racing. And now on to the really, really nice looking diecast. What's cool about this diecast is that they have the same exact spoiler. Uh, what they used to do back then, they put on the roofs. For the Speedway. I uh, believe this was Richmond. I'm not for sure, but... They even got that little camera there, which should be black, but whatever. So on the front, first of all, I'll go around with damage and any dirt. On the front nose, there's nothing really. Going to the side, there's a tire. Someone got into, got into Dell, or Dell got into someone. On the side, nothing much. On the back, I don't think there's anything. There's nothing on the back. On the side, we got a lot of damage. And there's a little bit of a tire rub right there in the quarter panel. Oh, wow, I didn't even know they had that down there. I think that's pretty cool. They got a bunch of tire marks right here, which I can tell this probably was Richmond. Because of all of that scrape marks. Rubbing against other people. Bunch of tire marks. What do you see? That's about like a good 20 tire marks there, maybe? Quite a bit. That looks pretty cool. Now, let's say we got those little, um, I don't know what you call them, but they're on like every race car. I think they're for like electric or something like that. For uh, the batteries, maybe. I don't know. Got a real nice, quite a bit of damage on this car. However, there's one more diecast I know of Del Earnhardt that's a raced version, and it says Daytona Flip. Which is a very cool die cast. Which I hope I can find that eventually. And this is very, very detailed. On the inside, we got um, the black window net. They painted this individually. And they even painted the little shifter individually because that's a whole different color than the body. Which I wish they sold me die casts of this quality. It just sold for about the same price as NASCAR Authentics and the Lionel, um, the Gold Series, which sucks that they can't do this again, but whatever. More people are in the sport now, so they gotta make more, they have to make the ability to make more diecast for the cheap, for the less, least amount of money. That's what sucks, but really nice diecast. Pretty nice race one, has, an, has quite a bit of race scuffs on it. Pretty nice story. His last race win. So this will mean a lot to my uncle. So thank you guys for watching this review. And I'll see you guys later. Bye.